So did he continue to uh, work with these people on further films? Uh, well, as far as the actors were concerned, th this always strikes me as, uh, as extraordinary that having got these good results uh, with Cagney and Arlene Francis, that uh, as far as I know, there was never any conversation about them uh, working together again. Uh, while there was um, so much, uh, I mean, he, the people he liked, he used several times, I mean, uh, and with Marilyn Monroe, um, we know uh, that, that, uh, that she was extremely difficult uh, on uh, the Seven Year Itch, uh, and uh, so when he was asked why he'd cast her in Some Like It Hot, he said, I've got an Aunt Maisie in Vienna. Uh, who would turn up on time, knowing her lines, and would never complain about the hours that she had to work. Uh, but nobody would cross the road to see my Aunt Maisie. Whereas Marilyn Monroe had all those problems, um, uh, but she had a magic that uh, uh, drew people in, and one just can't imagine some like it hot particularly, being the film that it is without her presence. Uh, he worked a lot with William Holden all through his career, uh, uh, starting with Sunset Boulevard, um, but also Sabrina, uh, Stalag 17, uh, and, and then his penultimate film, Fedora, also starred uh, William Holden. Uh, Towards the end of his career, he, he seems to have found in Shirley MacLaine, who is of course one of the central people in the apartment, but she was also Irma La Douce, um, and Jack Lemmon, who I think made more films with him than anybody else, uh, and Walter Matthau, uh, people that he was also happy with. But one wonders why uh, not just Cagney, but uh, Kirk Douglas, who gave a magnificent performance in uh, uh, Ace in the Hole, uh, only ever made one film with him. Uh, uh, Marlena Dietrich, uh, who was said to be so difficult on uh, uh, A Foreign Affair, uh, he did leave it a long time, but she was cast again in Witness for the Prosecution. Uh, so I don't understand quite uh, because one presumes that, uh, particularly with Jack Lemmon, uh, but probably also William Holden, uh, he was writing those parts with them in mind uh, at the script stage, uh, and, and presumably could have done the same with uh, Kirk Douglas, or with Cagney, or with Arlene Francis, um, had he wished to do so. Uh, and it just seems a pity that uh, the, the, those potential performances are uh, forever lost.